Hey, what's going on, guys? Hey, we got some bad weather that's been coming through here the last couple of weeks, so just kind of wanted to remind everybody to be safe out there. Uh, just a few things to try and remember when you're out there. I know a lot of this, uh, many of you will know, and uh, you know some of it's going to seem like common knowledge, but just for those of you that are inexperienced out here dealing with these roads in this weather, uh, just a few things I want to mention. Uh, maybe help you guys out out there. I first want to mention tires. Uh, make sure you have good tread on your tires. Uh, you get down there on them low, low uh, tread depth, and you're gonna you're just asking for trouble. So uh, make sure your tires are up to par. Next, I want to mention uh, don't use your cru cruise control when it starts getting uh, to where there's uh, a worry of ice or there's a lot of snow on the on the roads cruise control is not good it is not your friend I know we fall in love with that cruise control on uh, normal conditions but uh, make sure you keep that cruise control off of there you don't want to be driving around with that uh, hit a patch of ice you know may not be paying attention as well as you might if you were uh, had it off cruise if you come up on a bridge and you got that cruise on I mean you could lose it in a heartbeat I mean real quick like so keep that cruise control off on real bad conditions and when you're driving you know when you're just driving down the road and again uh, severe conditions as far as uh, a concern for ice or a lot of snow on the ground uh, the key places to be really careful is bridges uh, roads that are roadways that are above ground which is mostly a lot of these on ramps and off ramps uh, and those really be careful because those obviously a lot of them have curves to them and whatnot and uh, you know, many of us, I'm sure everybody has gone into one of them on ramps or off ramps a little too, too hard, uh, you know, a little too fast and you have to come to a stop a little, you know, slow down a little quicker. Uh, you do that on bad conditions and you're, you're done. You're going to hit a guardrail or play bumper, bumper pool on the uh, concrete barrier if there are some. So, uh, and also underpasses when you're going, uh, watch I call it going under an overpass, but yeah, when you're going under one, uh, it's very, very slick under there on a regular basis when it's when it's bad condition. This is a really bad spot. It's it's almost as bad as going over a bridge. Another thing to be uh, careful of and mindful of is when you're uh, switching lanes. When there's been a lot of snowfall, a lot of slush, uh, a lot of snow on the road, you you guys have seen that build up in the middle or even you know in between the the width of the tires on the on the lanes themselves uh, those are really treacherous especially when we aren't we aren't loaded in these vans uh, you see those big trucks and straight trucks and whatever you know they got a lot more weight holding them down and keeping that uh, keeping that uh, friction to the ground so we're light in the ass when we're not loaded and some of our loads are extremely light so when you hit those uh, it, it's just gonna push you or pull you and you know you could lose it real quick so you know be careful of that and also uh, same thing as far as uh, you know those kind of conditions ice and the snow and whatnot uh, don't let off the accelerator really hard I meant to mention that with uh, when I mentioned the bridges and whatnot don't you don't want to come to a like you're, you're cruising along and then you just let all the way off of the accelerator because that causes you know a little bit of a little bit of sudden stop and that could get you loose real quick and easy so Again, be careful of letting off the gas too quick. You know, hard braking. Obviously, you don't want a hard brake. Um, uh, also, with the travel, obviously, you know, keep a really, really good, safe distance because you don't know what they're going to do up ahead of you. So, you got to be prepared for that. No matter how good of a driver you are, you've also got to remember that there's other people out there on the road with you that may not be as good. When you're out here in these uh, snow and slush and a little bit of rain and, and wet, Make sure you got your uh, got some good wipers. All of us have been through those bad wipers and how tough it is to see, especially at night. You get that uh, headlight glare coming at you. I mean, you, you, I mean, you're kind of kind of guessing sometimes there. Uh, me personally, uh, when I get that kind of glare or whatnot, I'm always looking down for the for the side stripe to the shoulder, and that's kind of where I keep my focus and just keep in line with that. But uh, sometimes you may not even have that and that'll just blind the shit out of you just that glare because you know just obviously you guys have seen it just lights up the whole windshield and when we're dealing with the uh very cold temperatures to below freezing 
make sure you got the right wiper fluid in there that goes along with having your good wipers have a have the below zero uh, washer fluid in there and always keep some extra with you I've got two gallons back there uh, I just came up here to Maine I'm up here in Maine right now and uh, I went through a whole gallon on the way up here so uh, keep plenty of washer fluid with you you know it just you just got to be able to see man I mean if you don't see obviously you're gonna have a lot of problems you're not gonna be able to see the ice you're not gonna be able to see how much snows out there in front of you so keep your wipers up keep your fluid with you and one last thing I want to mention uh, you know during the day a lot of times the temperatures are above freezing and then at night they kind of get hovered near you you know you have some of those nights during the winter where you're just hovering right around freezing or it's supposed to get just below so you're kind of like not sure what's going on uh, helpful tip that I've had my dad told me about it. he's old school trucker uh, reach out to the back of your mirror uh, and see if you have any ice on the back of your mirror whenever there's precipitation obviously if there's some kind of you know that if you're looking for ice on the road obviously there's some kind of you know precipitation out there so just reach out to the back of your mirror and see if you feel any ice on the back of that there's a good chance that if it's on the back of your mirror that it's gonna be you know on the road so just just a little helpful tip if that if that works for you if you think Okay, guys, that's all I that's all I have for right now, man. But if uh, there's something I didn't mention that you guys think is is you know important, please put it in the comments below. And uh, I you know I, I don't think I don't think that I know everything by a long shot, so I'm just giving out some tips that I think of that I feel is uh, necessary and you know to keep me safe. So if there's anything you guys have out there, any little tricks or whatnot, you know, let us know, man. Put them in the put them in the comment section. We're out here to help each other. And again. If you didn't hit that subscribe button, hit the subscribe button, and uh, please like it if you like it, and if not, hit the, hit the thumbs down, man. Just, uh, you know, let me know what's going on. Everybody be safe out there.